I'm on Guam, on Guam people, thems. Uh, so, if some of you have been watching me for a little bit, you'll know that I did a Super Bowl series of reactions because I never really watched any. Um, and the person that won the, or got the top spot, as in like the best Super Bowl performance ever, uh, was Prince. Beyonce came okay, second. I have to be at the standard, of course, I have to get that in, of course. Um, and I said from then, I was like, right, okay, I need to delve into Prince because I haven't really, I don't know whether my Prince acumen, my Prince knowledge is like the same as everyone else's. And obviously when everyone's like gushing over Prince, I'm like, I'd love to, but I just, I don't have that same connection as other people have. And then I went live not that long ago and I reacted uh, live to him performing with uh, Shaka Khan for Sweet Thing. Yo, when I say, if in fact, I might see if I can find uh, that live and uh, upload that because it was so sick. I, I, it was amazing. And I can imagine being in that audience, like it would have been so electric. Um, so one of my patrons, Brianda, a big up Brianda, um, very kindly sent me like a little list of print songs I probably should like try and check out. Um, and actually there are so many in here that I don't know. Um, so I would die for you. I don't know that one. Um, the beautiful ones I know only really because Beyonce covered it at Glastonbury. Um, Adore. May have heard that one. That does sound familiar, but let's go crazy. Don't know that one. When doves cry. Now, that is a tune. That is a tune. I know. I, I do know that song. Um, and I want to be your lover. Don't know that one. So yeah, I'm gonna do like a little bit of a of a, of a print digging. Digging, digging dive. Um, so this one is I Would Die For You. So let's see what it's saying. I'm so excited. <laughs> Is that him? I oh, know that's him. Yo, that can dress though, guy. <laughs> They all look fabulous at that stage. I'm something that you never understand. I never 
never be true. I never lied. If for evil, I forgive you by and by. Cause you say. Something that you never comprehend No need to worry, no need to cry He's your Messiah and the only reason This is so sick Dude, I need to watch a Prince concert. Sorry, like from that alone, from that alone, I'm like, nah, I need to watch a Prince concert. I'll press there. Um, that was just so many elements of things that I'm just like sick. Like he owned that stage. Like from the minute, even before the lights even came on. Like he is, he's here. He's there. He's sliding over there. Like he's got this sick punch out fair thing all in white looking like some some sick venetian like you know what i mean with all the silks all the silks um i don't know what the bandana thing was but then the big a is hair and he look he, he i can tell from that already yeah from that already so i've now seen um snippets of the super bowl performance i've seen him performing um the song that loaded to uh, Patreon, but um, I don't, I think it got blocked by YouTube, so I don't think I was able to share it on YouTube, but it was so good. Like, it, it was him um, singing and basically him telling the crowd, I can't remember what the song's called now, but like, he was basically telling the crowd that, no, 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 I need you to sing this the way I need you to sing this, otherwise we ain't going any further forward. <laughs> and it was so much vibes, it was sick. Um, and then obviously watching him sing with Shaka Khan, but this, like the again high octane like massive energy because someone was was recounting a tale of him and apparently well allegedly anyway i don't know if it's, if it's even true it might have been an urban legend but one of the reasons that like him and michael had beef or that he beefed with michael jackson um was because like the, there was something that happened with him dancing on the same stage and michael with um uh what's his name uh oh my god look okay. at um i feel good i knew that i would so good it's like james brown um apparently james brown got him on the stage and uh, it, uh, something happened anyway like prince ended up falling off the stage or something and apparently um he felt that like he got set up by michael because so, michael was, was saying you gotta get you gotta get prince on this on the stage um and apparently he, he he then fell or something off some like lamppost that wasn't fixed to the stage, and I think sort of he, he then felt that that, that MJ had um, had uh, set him up to fail or something like that. But I don't know how true that is anyway. But I've never actually seen him obviously with all the dancing and, and all of that. I mean, I I saw one performance with him and Beyonce, and again like it was giving energy, but this. Was something different. My mum was spinning and a turning and a and a and a and a and then what? Because I was like, what? Well, you must be hot. There's no way you're doing all of that and you're not hot. So when he bust open the shirt, I'm like, yeah, he's hot. <laughs> but again, vocals like um very easy to kind of like do all of that and still 
like consistently set these so these vocals out and then move from that kind of like rah, like that raucous bit of his voice it's like the smooth bits of his voice um now nah, that was sick i thought that was really really good and can we like just give it up for the people who's got on stage as well like my woman on the drums and the percussion or whatever with the mink <laughs> which i'm presuming isn't real uh before i have anyone come after me for that um i mean i didn't wear it so anyway um but yeah, she's doing all what she's doing, whatever, looking absolutely 10 to 10, 10, 10, 10 10s across the board, fabulous. Um, and then my, my woman with the guitar just kind of slouched in, did a little harmony, and then just slouched back off again with the 80s hairdo and the 80s jack. Yo, vibes, absolute vibes, loved it loved it, absolutely loved it. Um, so yes, Miss Brenda, thank you for that. Uh, I don't know if I was meant to maybe watch like a recording as opposed to the live version of that, but um, I went for the one with the most views, 6.5 million, and they weren't wrong. That was really good. I would die for, for you. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, tune. Oh, I cannot wait to get into more of him. Honestly, like this is, this is, I'm already like gassed, as you can clearly see. So yes, um, I'd love to know what you guys thought of this, of this performance, um, of the ones I've mentioned already. Like, have you seen those? Um, What's your favourite Prince performance? What do you think my next one should be? Um, so yeah, let me know in the comments. If you did enjoy this, then do drop me a like and subscribe. That would be amazing. Thank you very much. Uh, and I do have a Patreon as well. So if you do want to head over there, show me any kind of love on any kind of tier, I'd be very, very grateful. Um, but for now, thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you on the next one. <laughs>